Getting the mighty TM dirty again, I see. Yeah, oh yeah, it's filthy. We're mucking out. <laughs> uh, M. I need M to sort this job out because I don't even know how to turn turn camera around. How do you turn camera around and we're live? Have you any idea? Uh, <laughs> try maybe that one. Yeah. Oh, flip camera. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's how mucky it is, look. Anyway, this is the first time I've gone live and it's actually worked because on my old phone it never did. Um, so yeah, this is it. We're going to... Let's take, take it off this phone holder here. So I've actually managed to get a phone holder for the TM. We're going to do a bit of um, cleaning up in here. So... This is our shed that we call the path and it's the first shed that we put up on this farm and um, we just started with this shed um, and we only just had enough cattle to fill it and then over years, I think we've been here about 18 years now, we've um, just kept adding sheds every couple of years with permitted development uh, planning applications and then we've got to sort of the size that we are now. So yeah. We are shifting shit. So let's have a look. Who's there? Main man, how are you? Ben Ben Kirk 48. I'm good, I'm good. MZ2. Yeah, yeah. Yo! Evening. <laughs> and we've also got Ash down on the farm. Um, we've got Ralph and Rob who are carting who work for um, a local arable farmer. They're carting muck away from us, but we're just waiting for them at the minute because we're uh, they're, they're cutting it a bit of a distance, sort of three or four miles. Uh, someone says, "Where's M?" James says, "Where's M?" Yeah. She's here. <laughs> so, yeah, what's everyone else up to? What are you all doing? Do you grow crops? Yeah, we do have arable. Um, not not a lot. Um, I don't want to go into numbers or anything like that because I'm not really into dick slinging, as I say. Um, yeah, we grow wheat, we grow barley, um, we grow maize, um, we got some oilseed rape, which some of you might have seen um, on the YouTube yesterday. Um, it's getting hammered by the pigeons at the moment. So yeah, we do grow crops, David, yeah. So, yeah, what's everyone else up to them? Oh, M is just sorting out a bit of hay there. So there we're in this pen here. We've got some new cattle and um, they're just fed a little bit of our meal but they always have hay in front of them so that um, so they've always got something to eat and um, as you can see they like it so, doing a good job there em cracking harvesting sugar beet yeah, we used to grow sugar beet, um, but we've not done since we started growing maize. Really, um, we stopped grow, we stopped growing the sugar beet. Um, well, actually, we sold we sold a British sugar contract, and um, we grew fodder beet um, for the last four, four or five years. But um, yeah, for the last two years that we've grown maize, we've not grown sugar beet. So. Whipping gorse off in West Cornwall. All right, what's that with like a, a topper or what's the deal with that? Are they steers your cattle? Uh, yeah, pretty much the majority are. We do have some, we do have some heifers as well. And we've actually got one cow on the farm at the minute. Um, but that's like, we never have, we never have cold cows, but um, just it came in a packet and yeah we've got one there mostly all Aberdeen Angus um, although we do have some Herefords um, and then we do have some Continentals as well but not many really it's mainly all Angus um, let, let M on the JCB she always goes on JCB but mucking out it's um, she needs a little bit more experience before she starts mucking out um, but she'll get there she'll get there so just at the minute she just does like driving stuff around the yard for us helping us and um, fetching bales she'll do a bit of that um, 
what else she's been doing? Oh, she did a mix the other day, but um, as some of you might have seen in the videos, um, oh, I didn't get the footage of it, but she tipped it over the other side of the uh, over the other side of the mix wagon. But uh, no, she'll get there. She's she's uh, she's a fast learner. So when it comes to summer, and we get really busy, and um, we always have somebody on the loader tractor in the field, so she'll crack on with. Um, She'll crack on with that and she'll get loads of experience doing it. She did have she did have quite a few hours at it um, this uh, this last summer, because that's when she started. Um, so yeah, get loads of experience then. How's the new job going? <laughs> what new job? Uh, yes, topper and streamer. Oh yeah, yeah. Streamer. Oh, so you got to go handheld. Yeah, nice. Ash, Ash is on it. Ash, we all know you're the mister. So, hi Alex, you all right? JCB, it's behind me there, look. And, I don't know if you can see, but it's filthy already, dusty. Um, the main thing though is, Sure, it's still on here. Still, I don't know if that's, uh, that might be mirrored actually. We've still got it on. It's not going, it's not leaving. Most of the time the door's folded back so you can't see it. But just so when everybody knows when I'm driving down the road, the website's there. So it looks like, how do I get rid of this, Em? What? That bit. Oh, that's it. Uh -oh. We're just getting used to this live stuff. Uh, she's a star, like, a uh, big fan of yours, Joe, love the videos. She is a star, she is. Absolute legend. Who's a legend? I know, I, don't, I, do, I do do a lot of work, believe it or not. Um, I'm, ne nice. I'm never not here. So we've got a trailer coming in now. That's Ralph. He's uh, on his 2.15, is it? Uh, 10, is it? Oh, 2.15, isn't it? It's a, bit, it's a bit newer than ours. 14 plate. So he's on that. <clears throat> oh, it's still 10. Is it? Oh. That's all right. No. I got told it were a 215 this morning, but yep, I can't read. It is a 210. So we're back on it now. Nice view of me Hiya Ian, we all right? Ian says hi. Hi Ian. Um, so yeah, we're going to start filling this trailer. <laughs> Ash, are you still watching us from up the yard? What tractor do you use on the pit? Um, right, so we have a contractor in and this last year he used a 7270, something like that. A seven, yeah, 7 Series John Deere with a big book rate on the front. But um, the year before that, um, he fetched a piston bully, which is, um, if you've seen like the ski slopes, it's a tracked machine with a big blade on the front, and um, they use that for pushing up. Um, it was some weapon like, but it couldn't quite really keep up with the, it's a big John Deere um, forager. Don't ask me what number it is, I'm not sure. It's the, I think it's the biggest one that John Deere do. And it couldn't quite keep up with it when um, when it got going full. Uh, so yeah, but when we have the uh, the big John Deere on it, it, it seems to it seems to work alright. And then we'll put like one of our tractors on, like the 210, and roll at the side of it just to help compact it down a bit. So. Yeah, Ash is watching. <laughs> you can just come down yard, Ash, and jump on if you want. Uh, what else have we got on there? 
<laughs> when are you gonna let me come and volunteer on your farm? Hiya Nick, you alright? Um like I say we get we get quite a few people wanting to come down and it's um it's difficult because um I say we're training them at the minute and having to train somebody else and uh, it's it just gets uh, it just gets a bit difficult when you're trying to train a couple of people at once so at the minute we're sort of full on staff like uh, odd time like on a Sunday but I quite like quite like being on my own sometimes on a Sunday gets me away from him eh? Yeah. <laughs> so, who else we got on here? Uh, you got it at Ian Roberts oh that's Ash my boss is in London, so I'm on all duties. Doing it all! What's he doing in London? Having an holiday? I think, I don't know if anybody else is um, like local to South Yorkshire. I'm, I'm not sure if Ashley's still watching this. But um, I know Farmstar are having an open day on Thursday. And Em's not going to be going because she's at college, and um, she actually goes to college one day. One day, so she can't skip that. Um, but I think I might have a little trip up to uh, Farmstar and have a look around there. Um, hopefully, if we get all the jobs done, uh, we did some all cop. Yeah, we've done all cop before. Uh, we used to do all cop wheat before we did maize. Quite liked it actually. Um, good crop to grow. They reckon it's um, a reliable crop to grow compared to maize as well. So they reckon maize you can have a, a bad crop in every five years. Um, touch wood, we've not had one yet, but when it comes, I'm sure I'll be moaning about it. Quality videos as always. So I'll have to keep pushing on with her farm work. She'll be. Up there soon. Keep pushing on, Em. She will. She'll. Uh, she's got the work ethic to make it. Uh, to make it work. So she'll. Uh, she'll go far in farming. Because, uh, I don't think school will offer you work, Em. We'll not talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> but farming, she's learning a lot about farming. And uh, she's uh, she's got common sense, which uh, a lot of, a lot of young people don't have at this uh, this minute in time. Sorry if I'm going a bit quiet. I'm uh, I'm just getting a bit tight in here. We're just getting the last few bits out of this shed and then we're going to go into, we're going to straw that up yep. um, and then we're going to yeah, gonna move some cattle from a pen that we call Stanley's um, into this pen that we've just done now and then we're going to move that out. Um, Ryan Farmer says hi Em. Um. Hi Ryan. See you both later. See you Nick. Thanks for checking in. Um, so yeah, what's everyone else up to? How do you see how many people are watching this? Then? Uh, top right corner. Oh yeah, yeah, F 50, 54 people. Jesus, we've never, we've never had 54 people in this shed before. Let me tell you that. <laughs> three if we're lucky. Yeah, three if we're lucky. Four good. if it's never. No, we've had four. We've had four. Me, Remember Ash, when you were doing your, yeah, you're doing your dance, weren't you? Then I came in. That was just a dream team. Uh, what more do you want? Hey, old Coco Mac, you alright? Joining in from Scotland, How's, what's it like up there? Cold. <laughs> um, yeah, you should all, all look at Coco Mac's uh, page actually, because there's some real nice views on there. And. Um, 
is uh, showing off his. Um, but your silage pusher? Uh, no, not silage pusher. Your silage cutter, weren't it? Silage pusher. Uh, quite satisfying to watch that, mate. Cooking a bale of that. Doing lives now. Waiting for plaster to dry. Oh. Is that like watching my videos waiting for plaster to dry? Yeah, no, we just just I don't know. Why we've decided to do a live today. Em's just on it, she's she's buzzing. And um I thought hey why not? Go live together with Danielle. Um, so yeah, just figuring this live thing out really, I don't know how it would go, but um, in a minute or so we're probably going to have to leave you because we're going to have to shift some cattle around, but whether we come back on, we might do if we get time. Yeah, I hope, um, hopefully we've got some good footage of today on our, going to be going on the YouTube. Oh, I hope so. Keep plugging that. Em's hoping so, because she's done a little review of a tractor. Yeah, the big class that was in there. <laughs> AKA, in Em's words, <laughs> weapon. No, we, we, you didn't say it like that, did you? Weapon. Weapon! Oh, yeah, she got a bit excited about it, bless her. Uh, moving up in the world, isn't it? <laughs> moving up in the world doing lives. Uh, I don't know. I quite like um, I quite like doing just videos, really. But just thought it's one of them days. I'll try it. I'm in a good mood. Let's try a live. Go for gold. Go for gold, eh? That's it. Oh, what have we got else in here? Class R scrap. Um, yeah, I don't really know. We've never had a class tractor. Um, quite a few at yard. Quite a few at yard, yeah. yeah. They seem to like them. Um, I'd say they prefer John Deere's, but I don't think they're a bad tractor. Tell Ash to get some work done. I know. He's working today, he's getting paid from his job. He's on, I don't know if he's on call or something. What are you on, Ash? Spare driver. Spare driver, that's what he is, spare driver. So he's getting paid eight hours to just come and have a play around on farm. Play time <coughs> on the farm, you know? But don't tell any of his colleagues because he might be pissed off. <laughs> he's doing fuck off. Um, uh, oh, it says he's, Ash says he's busy. Very busy. We used to park in the corner of the field in the miner, pretending he was full and waiting to be tipped. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like him. Oh, he's a good lad, is Ash. He's a mister. He's a mister, as Em said. We need Big Mick on a live, don't we? He'd love it. He would love it, like, he'd tell you some stories. He'd get his life story in, like, not quite ten seconds. <laughs> uh, He'd be like a kid on Christmas Day. Wouldn't he? Absolutely. Ah, this will, But, we have just got the last little bits out of here. Well, I'll just, I'll just read these last few comments and then we're going to be going. We might come back on if we get time. We'll see how, see how things pan out. Why do you go for John Deere's when you got the fence to have? <laughs> Cause then fence just it just did. Honestly, I could talk forever on that. So maybe that's uh, that's for another day. I'll talk. I'll, I'll tell you about that later. Nothing wrong with the trailer driver. She had to. <laughs> right. Okay. So thanks for tuning in, guys. Like I said, it might be something that we do again. Um, but we'll have to see. But we've got some cows to move and 
we're not going to do it on a live, so um, we need to be, have as wicks of hours. I will see you all later. Thanks for tuning in. Bye now. I don't even know how to turn it off. I don't turn it off. Ever.